Automotive manufacturers often rely on third-party logistics providers like this company, Midwest Express, to receive, store, pick, and deliver parts in sequence to manufacturing plants. This facility in East Liberty, Ohio, does just that. We receive those parts here, um, and then we distribute them to different facilities nationwide uh, for assembly plants and two uh, drivetrain plants as well as 216 different OEM suppliers. So basically we take things from overseas, uh, sequence them, and send them to different plants across the United States. Recently, the East Liberty plant installed a Muratech FX Quad automated storage and retrieval system to store and sequence the parts for line-side delivery to the manufacturing plants. The system replaced manual pick processes where workers selected products from floor locations onto pallets and carts. Those operations lacked the speed needed to meet productivity demands. Plus, relying on manual processes also created some problems that further drove the need for automation. Uh, manpower shortage in this area, a low level of unemployment, so there's not a whole lot of manpower and workforce out there available. That was the main driver of this project. Um, as well as in the warehousing industry and logistics industry, space is always at a premium. So those two things were our main drivers. This project helped us to mitigate both of those concerns significantly. Midwest Express reached out to DMWNH, a warehouse consulting and systems integration company, to find a solution to solve these key concerns. Midwest Express had worked with DMWNH previously on another project and had confidence in their solutions. Basically, we take each one of the characteristics that's very important for us in a project, we weight those based on merit, and then we score them based on what we feel each provider can provide in that area. So once we did that, the decision analysis came out that DMW and H, as well as Murata, would be the right choice for our business and our application. Parts arrive at East Liberty in containers from overseas and domestic suppliers. They are unloaded at a facility docks and sent to decant stations, where individual cartons are removed from pallets and prepared for placement into the ASRS. In many instances, the original carton can go directly into the system, while other parts are removed from their shipping cartons and placed into totes suited for the automation. The goal was to have about 80% of all parts coming into the facility stored within the ASRS. With a variety of different size cases, containers, uh, and conveyances, they were able to accommodate each different size that we had requested be placed into the system, as well as others that can range from the minimum size we gave them to the maximum size. The FX Quad system provides fast movement of parts with the capability of handling 450 cases in and 450 cases out per hour, or 900 total moves hourly. That high volume is achieved because each of the three cranes in the system can handle four cartons or totes at a time. The cartons and totes are gathered at the input stations and whisked off to storage positions. There are 18,000 double deep locations within the three aisle system. The products will remain in storage anywhere from one hour to two weeks until they are needed for orders. Meanwhile, the system continuously re-slots the cartons and totes to position faster moving products and those needed for upcoming orders closer to output stations. This reduces the travel distance for the cranes and saves valuable processing time. When needed, the same cranes pick up totes and cartons in sequence. They are taken to output stations and then conveyed to workers who palletize them. Lift trucks load the pallets onto trucks for the short ride to the manufacturing plants. All associates love the fact that the parts come right to them, they don't have to pick them up. It reduces the handling of pulling the part from the location, putting it on the cart, taking it to the pallet. It's just reduced the amount of lifting and moving of the part. Yeah, it's a lot better. Time-wise, it takes an average of 32 seconds to pull a part out of the SRS, as a floor pick it takes about a minute and 15 seconds per pick. So that's per conveyance, so it sped up our production immensely. All the project objectives were met. We actually uh, reduced about 35,000 square feet of, of open space. 
Um, and we also reduced uh, job need by 23 associates. So we were able to take those 23 associates and redistribute them around in different operations in our company. All of our throughputs, capacities, and capabilities were met, as well as productivity. And on a daily basis, we see that it helps us complete our business while you know, redeploying those 23 associates and opening up that space. So essentially, each objective we had was met um, within a timely manner. The automated systems have been very cost effective, and managers have found the ongoing support offered by DMWNH and Muratech to be exceptional. As far as equipment wise, it's, it's very reliable. They were actually great to work with, um, very easy to communicate with. Even today, when I call the help desk for a situation through Neurotech, they're, they're, uh, they call you right back. Um, they get on situations really quick, very reliable.